into the temptations. Just like we shouldn't give into the temptations. And we can try not to give into the temptations. And we shouldn't give into the temptations. And we have to fight. We have to fight. The devil tempts us every single day. He tries to get us to go to hell. Do you really want to be tortured every day and raped every day? No. Turn to Jesus. It's never too late. Turn to Jesus. It is never, never too late to turn to Jesus. Jesus always forgives you. He'll always love you. He'll always be there. And I'm not saying I don't sin. Everyone sins. Everyone sins. I sin all the time. I don't like that I do. I try not to. But I sin all the time. All the time. All the time. No one's perfect but Jesus and God. Like, God's. God is the only perfect person. No one else is perfect. Everyone sins. I'm a sinner. We're all sinners except for Jesus. We're all sinners. When the devil offered Jesus instant authority over the world, the Lord reminded himself that God alone deserves worship. God deserves worship. And when the devil dared Jesus to prove the Father's care, the Lord refused to test God. Never test God. The devil tempts us in ways we wouldn't even think is temptation. He tries to trick us. And for everyone like who is saying that my mind is I'm brainwashed you the devil is tempting you and he's messing with your mind and he's tricking you and you're falling for it you are giving into the temptation it's never too late it's never too late to turn to God and never too late to stop Recall his trustworthy promises to you in the Bible. Resist the devil and he will flee from you. If you resist the devil, he will flee from you. God protects us from the devil. And if you resist the devil, then he will leave you alone. Not forever. He tempts us every day. But God protects us. You don't have to be like... I'm never scared. Sometimes like... Literally, sometimes, like, the craziest thing will be going on, like, everyone's like, oh, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, and they're like, and they're like, Faith, how are you not scared right now? Because I have Jesus. God will keep me safe. God will keep me safe. And if I die, then I die, and it was my time to die. God has a plan for all of us. If I die, then that was all a part of my plan. That was all a part of, that was his plan for me. I guess my plan was to die then. If I die, that was his plan for me. But I always feel safe because I know Jesus is there with me and that he'll keep me safe and he'll protect me. Okay, guys, I think I don't want to leave the live, but it's like 1040. It's like 1040 and I have school tomorrow and like won't get home until 9 p.m. So Okay, I think I'm going to go to bed because I'm really tired and I need to get sleep. But I hope that this live meant something to all of you. And I really hope that, I really hope that all of you guys just, I really hope that this like helped you in any way. I hope that this was a sign to you that you can turn to God still and that he'll forgive you. And I hope that this is a sign that you can strengthen your relationship with God. And you can always come to me if you need anything. Like, please, message me on TikTok. Message me on Instagram. Like, come to me. Because if you need, like, anything or want to talk, I'm there for you. I'm there for you. 
I will be there. I will be honest with you. I will help you. Just please come to me. And I hope that this just, I hope that this just showed you and helped you. And I hope that really like, I hope that you can strengthen your relationship with God. And I just really hope that all of you guys can go to heaven. And I hope that heaven will be crowded. I just really hope that everyone on here thinks about God tonight more. And maybe a few people on here decided to believe in God or are thinking about God more or just simply just prayed tonight or are trying now to strengthen relationship with God. Thank you. Thank you all. Wonder Kid 2000, I'm praying for you tonight. I'm going to pray for all of you tonight and I'm just going to pray that all of you can can find God and that all of you sleep well and have a great life. I'm going to pray for all of you that you can find God and just be happy. Just find God and really strengthen your relationship with God. I'm going to pray for all of you that you can all believe in God. I'm going to pray for all of you. But um yeah so i love you all thank you so much for everything i'm always gonna be here you can always come to me and i'm gonna start posting like jesus like coffee talks so i'm gonna be like making coffee in the morning and talk about god so yeah i love you all just know i'm always here and also i know how you're saying nothing fails like prayer this is a silly story well actually i have two Oh my gosh, I have a mustard seed um, right there. There. I have a mustard seed actually right there. Uh, you can't see it. It's right there. I have a mustard seed right there. Um, two thing for like prayer. You say prayer always fails. This is really a silly story, but me and my friend, it was like snowing out. It was freezing and we walked all the way from her house to Target. And we were, because we were really hungry or something like that. I don't remember. And we walk into the store and my leg broke. Like, my leg snapped. My prosthetic leg. And I, because I only have one leg. Um, if you didn't know. And my leg snapped. And then I prayed to God. And I literally go, God, please just, please. Like, I really hope that my friend's sister's here. Like, I randomly were just, we were like, oh, please have my friend's sister be be here we said her name like please have her here like please have her just randomly be here so she can take us home what happened we turned the corner guess who's standing there her sister because her sister had to go and get food and we had no clue that i swear on my life that is a true story that is a true story and we also said when we were praying we're like My friend will come to church with me tomorrow because that was on a Saturday and we were having a sleepover and I was leaving to go to church in the morning. I'm like, if she's here, we'll go to she'll I'll bring her to church with me tomorrow. Um and so when her sister was there and brought us home and everything was okay, my friend went to church with me the next day. And she just felt so much happier and just it was amazing. One other really quick story and then I'm gonna go to bed. But another story which I think is super cool. I was, it was, um, I was on a road trip going to Tennessee again because my leg broke. This is a different time. My leg breaks all the time. This is a different time, but my leg broke and I had to, I get my legs made in Tennessee. So I was on, yes, I can keep your family in my prayers. Um, but basically I was on a road trip to Tennessee and it was two in the morning because we left super late at night and it's two in the morning and we're in Tennessee. So there's mountains. It is pitch black on the road pitch black and there is lightning striking and it's hailing and it's like icy and the car i literally i i was asleep because i sleep when we're on road trips and i just open my eyes i wake up and the car is swerving all over the road my mom's like freaking out she's like stop the car pull over pull over my dad's freaking out my mom's about to cry because she thinks we're gonna die like she literally thinks that we're gonna die and get in a car crash and die and i woke up because it's pitch black you can't see it was bad it was really bad we, it was really bad and i woke up and right away well i literally right away i just started praying and i go god please keep me and my parents safe please keep us safe please just please keep us safe just 
please keep us safe. Like, please help us in this situation. I love you so much. Thank you for everything. Amen. Right after I say amen, amen, I go, amen. And it stopped. The rain just stopped. I swear on my life. Like, I, I swear. I swear that happened. You, I will ask my parents tomorrow and take a video of them saying yes. Like, I prayed. I said, amen. And the rain stopped. And I literally look at my mom and I go, I just prayed. And it stopped. He kept us safe. He kept everyone on that road safe. God is real. If that's not enough for you, then I don't know what is. God is real. God protects us. God keeps us safe. Just please turn to God. I love you all. If you have any questions to ask me about God or just want to talk to me in general, even if it's not about God and you just want to talk to me, you can message me here or you can go to my bio and go to my Instagram. I love you all. Thank you for everything. Amen. I mean, oh my gosh. I didn't mean to say that. I meant to say good night. My brain's messed up. I need to go to bed. It's too late for this. I should have been asleep an hour ago. But I love you all. I hope that this can be a little sign to you that God is real and that like just the fact that you're on this live, he brought you to this live for a reason. This is a message for all of you. This whole live today, what? Let me swipe. In total, I had 14k thousand people on here 14,000 people on here I think like more than half of those people have been like saying negative things and saying how God isn't real that is just proof God brought you all to this life for a reason he's trying to give you a sign that he is real if that's not the, if not if you don't have proof there is proof right there that God is real God wants you all to go to heaven God wants you all to go to heaven. He loves you all. He wants you to go to heaven. He wants you to turn to him. So if this, yeah, the For You page brought you to my life. God controls everything. God is the most powerful thing in the world, in anything. He's the most powerful person out there. He brought you guys to this life for a reason. This is a sign. He's giving you a sign. So maybe tonight before you go to bed, if you if it's night for you, I don't know what time it is for you, but if it's night for you, maybe before bed you can think about God. I love you all. I hope you have an amazing night. Good night. I love you all. Please talk to me if you ever need anything or if you just want to talk just because you want to talk or if you just want someone to talk to. I love you all. Thank you. Bye. Um, I'm going to go live soon and be posting, so make sure to follow me so that you can see... Oh, my stuff. I love you.